Hey yo, what's shaking? This is Mr. Cab Cabernet, lifestyle connoisseur. Let's talk about the distractions. These are confessions of a lifestyle connoisseur. 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 I'm pretty sure you never felt this kind of rule. One of the best daily go to daily smokes, bar none, in the world. Nicaragua has died again. Connecticut Broadleaf. But enough about that. That's just a distraction. You see? Today we're going to talk about the distractions. What's distracting you? Why, why can't you focus? Why can't you get to the bag? Why can't you get to the source? Why can't you get to the goal why can't you get to the finish line what is stopping you what's holding you back what's taking you off track what is this tracked in you That which distracts you takes you off of track. Words have meanings. What is distracting you? The reason why you cannot reach your full potential, become the best version of yourself, reach your goals, is because you're distracted. We can make excuses all day, it's, it's this or that and the third, but it all comes down to distractions. And the great thing about distractions is that distractions are all in your control. What you choose to let distract you, you can also choose not to let distract you. The main distraction of today, uh, social media. It's a great tool for learning and information and research and compiling data and learning. You can learn how to do anything really, if you're willing to learn and put the, the time in. It's on YouTube. You can learn how to do anything. You can study all types of data, statistics. You can uh, read books, listen to someone read a book for you. But unfortunately, most 
people are using social media to feed them distractions. The algorithms are feeding you distractions, foolishness, fuckery, nonsense. This one's fighting that one. This one's dating this one. And then this one is sleeping with that one while she's dating this one. This one over here used to be gay. Now he's not gay, he's trans. And he doesn't claim to be gay or straight. This one over here, this one said this about that one. And so now this one is saying this about that one and this one. Distractions. Look at her ass, it's huge. It's shaking in front of you. Distractions. Look at this guy. He's flashing all his money. He's driving his nice uh, Lamborghini. He's uh, uh, shining his diamond rings. Distractions. This guy right here, he's smoking a cigar. He's telling you about distractions. Distractions? You dig what I'm saying? Are you distracted right now? See, if you're on track right now, then this is not a distraction. I'm actually feeding you what more of what you need to stay on track. That is the value of this confession. Stop sitting around allowing yourself to be distracted with nonsense. If you're a man, number one distraction is women. Why? Because men are physical creatures and we see something, we see a woman, if, she, if we find her attractive, she distracts us. It's a, it's a visual thing. So this height, our, our distraction is heightened when we're on social media because you swipe left and swipe right and you're distracted by a thousand bodies and booties and titties, right? Twerking and working and jerking, berserking, okay? It's a distraction. You could have been looking online to trying to, on, on, the, on social media looking for a certain motivational speech like this one, but some ass, somehow uh, made it in front of you instead. It's a distraction. Now you gotta regroup. Yeah, okay, you go, you gonna go back and get your mind right. Distractions. <sighs> what are some other distractions? Your cell phone. One of the biggest distractions in the world. The number one reason for car crashes today are texting and driving. It's no longer drunk driving, drinking while driving. It's texting while driving. Why? Because mother fletchers have lost their minds and, and think that in their mind it's it's actually more efficient to actually look at their screen and type with their fingers 
while one or the other hand is driving the car and, and you're looking at the road and then looking at the phone. Instead of just telling someone to call you or just calling them and just, you know, talking. Everyone's lost their minds. Everyone's distracted by distractions. If you truly are trying to focus on something, it's important to totally unplug yourself from social media for a certain amount of time. It's just necessary because it's just too distracting. Or just don't follow anyone. Like, just stop following everyone and post whatever you're gonna post. That's one way to guarantee you won't be distracted by anything or just follow certain things that you choose to follow and don't click on anything that pops up on your 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 page so that you don't see once you click on something now you become part of that algorithm you understand because the artificial intelligence is you're telling it when you view something or click on something or like something or share something or whatever you're telling the artificial intelligence that this is something you want to see more of and things that are similar to this content so it's just going to start flooding you with you know content similar to that content and you start wondering one day why are all these asses popping up on my screen why because you looked at an ass and liked the ass you looked at two three asses now you got two three asses is an hour popping up in front you understand? It's a distraction. Once again, this is Mr. Cab Cabernet, lifestyle connoisseur. And these are confessions of a lifestyle connoisseur. These are confessions of a lifestyle kind of sore. These are confessions of a lifestyle kind of sore. These are confessions of a lifestyle kind of sore. I'm pretty sure you never felt this kind of.